Yo, what's good people? It's your boy Has From Home Dad back with another video. And I've been going over my previous videos, which was the five best ways to promote your ebook. I was watching it this morning and I thought, you know what, there's some gems in there that I just want to remind you of and for you to tap into that you can start using today to start selling a ton more ebooks. Now, as you already know, um I'm a uh, my background is in a musician. I used to own own a music studio in Barnet, which is in London. I transitioned from there because I had a child, so I got a full-time job. I quit the music industry and then I got tired of the working industry. But what I did was I learned a ton about marketing, advertising and all of that good stuff. So I went back online. I decided to relaunch myself. I ended up making a ton of money from music marketing myself and also a ton on Fiverr and also a ton selling digital products. Now I've done over 179k online selling digital products. Now in my spare time I make these videos to help you hustle from home so that you can build a side hustle, one that you can be proud of and one that allows you to spend less time with your boss and more time with your wife and kids at home. Okay that's enough of the introduction for me. Let's jump into the content. So when you're selling your ebook, obviously you have to have an ebook done, right? You have to have created it already. So let's move on. If you've already created your ebook, perfect, voila, congratulations. Find a platform to sell it on Amazon, Kindle, Gumroad, eBay, Etsy, wherever, throw it up. Set step, step number two done. Congratulations. Now, now it comes to the promotion time. This is where a lot of people fall short. It's easy to write it, it's easy to list it, but now you have to promote it, okay? And one of my favorite ways to promote online is the natural versus the selling way, right? So I'm gonna break down examples of what natural versus selling is and why I prefer to sell naturally and why others prefer to sell, it's hard sell, right? So for example, if you're selling an ebook on um, making money, you know, building wealth. Like maybe, I don't know, you work as a sales consultant or you worked as, I don't know, IT or you work as, I don't know, a real estate agent and you've written an ebook on selling and renting properties, okay? Now you've got your own personal Instagram. You can start making a ton of money just from your personal Instagram. And here's how you do it. Whatever you're posting on your everyday, everyday, um, I don't know, you wake up in the morning, you have a bowl of porridge before you go to the office, okay? You can turn that post into a sales pitch, right? In a natural way, and here's how you do it. So you pour your milk in, you've got your, you got your blueberries, you pour your sugar in, you mix it around, you put it in a microwave, you've just made yourself a bowl of, of porridge. You take a picture of you eating that porridge and you post, you know, the caption, getting my you know get my porridge in in on in the morning you know the foot the the most important meal of the day is breakfast and then you write underneath that caption ps right the most important um the most important meal of your day is is it should be dinner because it's your job as a father to put food on the table right if you want to learn how to put more food on the table and then you know increase your bank balance click the link in my description to learn how to rent a ton more houses or whatever do you see what we're doing we've linked porridge to breakfast breakfast to dinner dinner to men putting food on the table money voila Okay, you've naturally sold your ebook, you've plugged your ebook without even doing too much. Let's take another example, right? Um, I don't know, you are a uh, you're in you're in the gym, right? You go to the gym and you've written an ebook on on um how to build a muscular body, okay? So you go to the swimming pool and you're in the swimming pool and you say, you know what, I've just finished 10 laps, um, I feel good. If you want to dip your toes in the water and if you want to build the ideal body of a goddess right this second, click the link in my description box to go and download my absolute powerhouse of an ebook on how to craft and build a body of a god. Do you see what we've done? We've taken swimming, we've linked it with dipping your toes in the water to getting started, right? These are natural ways to plug whatever it is that you're selling whatever ebook you have this is the natural way to plug it and it's all about plugging you should be plugging your ebook every single day right every single day if you're not plugging your ebook so i just heard the sound if you're not plugging your ebook every single day then you are losing out on sales and the key to sales is selling every single day every single post you put out has the ability to bring in sales so you're doing yourself a disservice if you're not plugging your ebook every single day and the best way to do that like i said is through this natural way now here's what a lot of rookies will do they'll take a picture of their ebook and say my ebook is out now go and check it out that's what they'll do 
right? And that is what rookies do. That is what not that is not what we're doing. That is not how I was able to sell almost 200k revenue selling ebooks and digital ebooks, right? Um, or digital products. That's not what you do. Um, because what it does is for the reader and the looker and the viewer, they just go past it. There's no value in it for them. There's nothing in there. They, it, it's a plug, right? And our subconscious on filter, we have filters in the back of our brain that is designed to keep out things that aren't relevant for us, like sales pitches, like sales messages. Remember, we are bombarded with tens of thousands of information every single day. So our brains get really good with filtering out things that are for us and not for us. So you need to find a way to bypass people's filters to get to the man in charge, right? Because the subconscious is just filtering through a ton of information every day. That we need that, we don't need that, we don't need that, we need that. So in order to bypass that filter and the security guards of people's brains, you need to give like, Almost like a Trojan horse, you know, in Troy, where they get into the empire and they get through that, um, into the, into the, past the walls by turning up as a Trojan horse, right? And once they're into the empires and the doors are closed, they will jump out of the Trojan horse and start the war, right? The war on sales. See the link. So that's what you need to do. You need to bypass people's filters by simply just finding a way. So, for example, I've just cooked spaghetti bolognese, okay? I've just cooked spaghetti bolognese. The wife, is at work and um, obviously I'm hustling from home dad I work from home so I've done the school run today and uh, I picked the kids up brought them home they done their after school thing whatever they do they chill out you know watch tv or whatever and I, it was my job to make spaghetti bolognese that's the one dish that I can make I can't make anything else except spaghetti re a really good spaghetti bolognese okay so I put my wine in there I put my secret brown sugar in there a couple pinches that's my secret ingredients right those are my secret ingredients I take a picture, snap the, um, snap the picture, and then I say, made my famous, infamous uh, spaghetti bolognese with my secret ingredients, which I can't reveal. It's a secret, right? And, and then I put, I just close it out, and then I drop below it, P.S., if you want to learn the secret ingredients to building a side hustle online from the, from the beauty of your own home in your own time, then click the link in my description box for you to learn more. Do you see what I've done here? So the viewer has learned a few things. They've learned that I can cook spaghetti bolognese. They've learned a little bit about me, right? They've learned that I can't cook very many things, but what I can cook is spaghetti bolognese. They've learned that there's secret ingredients that are put in spaghetti bolognese, right? So it's creating curiosity, but then I've left them hanging. But I've also linked it through clever wordplay, um you know the secret ingredients but then first and uh, fourth and fo fourth and final they've also learned that there's a way for them to access the secret ingredients to working from home right and they can it can lead them down there so you see what we've done we've created a little story right and there's a saying that i love it's facts tell but stories sell right facts tell stories sell so i could tell them going down my ebook about building side hustles that's information people hate information but if i turn it into a story about spaghetti bolognese and it's the only thing that i cook and there's secret ingredients that i put in it and then round it off with them going to check out the secret ingredients that's hustling from home it builds a nice little story there's more entertainment there's more value there than just saying go and check out my ebook right so that's what i just want to really draw home with you right an amateur right now don't be an amateur don't sell just hard sell right um, really give value and like va this word value gets thrown around a lot these days but I think we're overthinking it it's not like you value isn't you have to give people gold you have to give people silver you have to give people a mint like value comes in three basic ways information entertainment or motivation if your if your if your marketing efforts or your posts can provide value in the form of information, not about your product though, not about your product, not information about your product, information about yourself, information about something. So I could say, you know, I just bought a new iPhone today. Did you know that 10, 100 million iPhones are sold every year? Okay. I just bought my iPhone because um, I dropped it down the toilet. It got wet. Hopefully this one lasts longer than two weeks. Okay, if you feel like your life is going down the pan, 
and going down the toilet. Click the link in my description box to learn how to build a side hustle from home, one that you can be proud of and one that you can build in the in your spare time. You see what I've did here? So I've given them, inf I've, I've rammed all information, I've rammed information, entertainment and motivation in, right, into one post. Just from taking a picture of my new iPhone box, right? So there's so much value here that I don't want you to sleep on. It's the natural versus hardcore selling. Nowadays, people are constantly bombarded with sales messages, advertisements, this, that. You need to find a way to sneak past people's security guards of their mind and sell to them and get past that, yeah? So I really want you to try this. It's a natural way of selling. You can use this through YouTube, like my YouTube channels, like I've given you value here. And at the end of the video, I'm going to plug my whatever I'm plugging, right? Because I've given you the value, okay? I'm giving you the value and I'll plug whatever. Wait for it, the plug's coming. Um, so I hope you got value from it. Here's the plug. If you, as a hustle from home dad, want to spend less time with your boss and more time with your wife and kids, right? And you want to do it through selling ebooks, click the link in my description box to go and download fit over 50, 50 of the best ebook topics that you can write your ebook about i put this together myself for you 50 of the best niches and topics that you can write about that's going to drive you towards 200k revenue like i've been able to do selling digital products and ebooks right get you there far as fast as possible right plug down so you can go and get the link click the link somewhere in this screen in the description box it might even be below this video right so and that is it it's your boy, Hustle From Home Dad, teaching dads how to hustle from home so you can spend less time with your boss and more time with your wife and kids. It's always a pleasure doing these videos. Um, I love the community that we're building and we're going to keep on building. I want a whole tribe of Hustle From Home Dads where one day I do an event and we all turn up with our Hustle From Home Dad t-shirts on and we all share stories. We all show our growth and our goals, you know, and... It's just a place where we can all come together, share, learn and grow, right? That's my dream. So again, I'll catch you in the next video. Catch you on the flip side. Keep selling those ebooks. Let's go. Let's go get it. Take care. Peace.